Chicago has a lot of nicknames, and we're adding a new one. The Sleep Happy City. Because back to bed embedding experts have joined Mattress Firm, Chicago's largest mattress retailer. Mattress Firm. Save money. Sleep happy. It's spent on treating cancer. But now one doctor says we can prevent Alzheimer's by changing our diets. What's making Americans overweight, tired, and sick? Too much red meat. Fats and oils, stuff like that. McDonald's. <laughs> this doctor says they're all wrong. Your key to weight loss is to eat more fat. Eat fat, get thin. Neurologist David Perlmutter, author of Grain Brain, says Americans should also be eating very so few carbs, just 60 to 80 found. grams a day. For more than 99% of our time on this planet, we are on a high-fat, low-carb, virtually gluten-free diet. Perlmutter says carbs cause a blood sugar spike. A recent study showed even small increases in blood sugar up the risk of dementia and type 2 diabetics have doubled the risk of Alzheimer's. Another study found the risk of dementia was 42 percent lower in those who consumed a higher fat, lower carb diet. We should prevent the disease because we know how to do that right now and it's not going to cost anything. Perlmutter has vocal critics who say some people may interpret grain brain as giving consumers the go-ahead to load up on high-fat meats and dairy. Perlmutter points right, to a recent go, study of more than 350,000 people that found no link between saturated fat and cardiovascular risk. That's the information that people have been receiving for decades and it has absolutely no scientific merit. The bottom line for Perlmutter he says history proves grains are not meant for our brains. This is a totally foreign diet for humans. We've never had carbohydrates like this in our diet. Perlmutter says load up on nuts, veggies, olive oil, eggs, wild fish, free-range chicken, grass-fed beef, avocados, and some dairy, but choose whole milk. He says stay away from trans fats, sugars, processed foods, and carbs. Cut out gluten and eat fruits sparingly. So we have posted all these tips from him on our website at abc7chicago.com.